function of the lungs is to exchange oxygen from the air to the bloodstream when you breathe in and carbon dioxide from the bloodstream to the air when you breathe out. Humans have two lungs side by side, but they're not the same size. The left lung is slightly smaller to make room for your heart. Each lung is divided into lobes. The right lung has three lobes and the left lung two. When breathing, air enters the respiratory system through the nose or mouth. Hairs in the nose and mucus in the sinuses trap dust and germs, and as air travels down the trachea, it's warmed and moistened. The trachea branches into left and right bronchi. Each bronchus branches into smaller and smaller bronchi, bronchioles, and finally into alveoli. A pair of lungs weighs 2.9 pounds. They have a spongy structure for a lot of surface area for gas exchange. When laid out flat, they'd cover an entire tennis court. The lungs can't expand and contract on their own. This movement is controlled by the diaphragm under the ribcage and the muscles between the ribs. The lung capacity will depend on a person's size, fitness, and even the altitude where they are on the earth. An average adult male has a 1.5 gallon lung capacity. Most adults breathe 12 to 20 times per minute, which amounts to 2,900 gallons of air per day. An average person can hold their breath for about two minutes. The epiglottis is a flap that protects the lungs from food and liquid when we swallow. Coughing and sneezing is the respiratory system's mechanism for getting rid of irritants like dust and pollen. Asthma is a respiratory condition where the airways constrict as a result of an irritant and breathing can become very difficult. A person is still able to live with only one lung, but their ability to do physical exercise is limited. Because the lungs are the only organs that exchange oxygen and carbon dioxide, it's very important to keep them healthy and clean. Smoking and air pollution damages lung tissue and leads to lung diseases like cancer and emphysema. The study of lungs is called pulmonology.